some smack em a god pizza skulls. What's up, everybody? I got me a um, donation here from uh, Sky Star. Wants me to put both classics. Sweet Desolation Boulevard. This is the sweet album I grew up on. Uh, first thing I ever owned of Sweet was Little Willie on the 45. One of the first albums I ever bought in my life. And, uh, but the first Sweet album I bought was this. And yeah, it's the American version, which I'm doing. This is the one I grew up on. I do know there's different versions with Teenage Rampage and so forth. Again, so uh, what many uh, people... Unlike, not many Kiss fans, but a lot of people would say this is the best Kiss album. Not me, actually. I would say it's my least favorite of the 70s, but I still love it. But I like this one more. I love the sweet. I mean, this band was just unbelievable. So let's do this, okay? All right. We're going to start with, uh, and if you ask me, in America... The Sweet is grossly underrated because for even more purpose than, than, than let's say, a Thin Lizzy or a UFO or stuff like that because Sweet actually had hits in America, you know, more than one. You know, what, Ballroom Blitz, Action, Fox on the Run, um, Love is Like Oxygen. I mean, that's four. That's about... As many hits Kiss has had. What has Kiss had? Rock and Roll All Night, Beth, Forever. Uh, you know, maybe they had a couple more. But whatever, let's get into this. All right, Sky, here we go. Uh, Ballroom Blitz versus Detroit Rock City. Man, I gotta tell you. Detroit Rock City would be my favorite. No, well, I don't know. Come on and love me, Detroit Rock City. I mean, those are my favorite Paul songs. But I think Ballroom Blitz is a better song. I think that song is just unbelievable. Great drumming, yelling, screaming, and, you know, just, I'm giving it to that. All right, then we got the 16s, I love that song, versus King of the Nighttime World. Um, I love them both, but this one, I gotta admit, is easy. I'm giving it to the cover song, King of the Nighttime World. No, You Don't, awesome song, versus God of Thunder. Awesomer song. I'm giving it to Kiss. All right, then we got ACDC versus Great Expectations. No brainer. Great Expectations. All right, that's the end of side one for Kiss, but we still got another song on the suite. So let's pick a random album up here. Talk about it for a second and get into side two. <sighs> my favorite Armored Saint album, and Armored Saint is like one of my favorite bands. If you saw my top ten favorite bands of all time, this was on my top ten, but then I had to take it out because it was such a pain in the ass, but man. For the sake of heaviness. Is that what they called it here? Yes. Because on the Chrysalis version, it just said for the sake. Because Chrysalis sucked. Um, You're Never Alone. Release that bass solo long before I die. Nervous Man. Over the Edge. Killer Bluesy track. Uh, the Laugh. Conqueror. Aftermath. The best song on here. Uh, in a Hole. Just unbelievable. Right on. All right. Let's go into side two. Well, we still have one, I mean, this is side one from here, was I want to be committed versus uh, Flame and Youth. Yeah, man, that's pretty much a tie. I mean, I like Flame and Youth a lot. I just hate the circus noises. But you know what? I am going to give it to a kiss. All right. Next, Fox on the Run. Love it. Versus Sweet Pain. No, no, I'm sorry. Sweet F.A. versus Sweet Pain. Both have sweet in the title. Um, <laughs> from the band Sweet. Um, I love Sweet Pain, but I'm... Uh, I don't want to know your name. Great, great song. I'm giving it to the Sweet. 
No, I mean, Sweet F.A. Dun, 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 dun. Still giving it to the Sweet. That's Iron Maiden before Iron Maiden, the galloping heaviness. Uh, all right, what's next? Fox on the Run versus Shout Out Loud. Love them both, but Fox on the Run. Uh, Set Me Free. Man, that's like thrash metal before thrash metal. Total proto-thrash. And yes, a thrash band from the Bay Area. Heathen covered it, and so did Striper, and so did Vince Neil, and so did a bunch of other people, versus Beth. I love Beth, but that's not even close, man. Sweet. Uh, Into the Night versus uh, Do You Love Me? I'm giving that one a kiss. All right. Uh, last song, Sol Solid Gold Brass, and uh, obviously... We're going to have to go with Rock and Roll Party, which was just a stupid amount of noise. So I'm giving that to the suite. So the suite got one, two, three, four, five, six, where Destroyer got four. Pretty close. Pretty close battle. Um, but as I said, I like this one more. But I do love this album. I don't hate it, I, even though I think it's my least favorite. You know, there's a lot of Kiss fans that agree with me. That this is their least favorite, but a lot of them dislike this album way more than I do. I don't hate this album. I think it's a great album. I think 70s Kiss, you couldn't go wrong unless you count some of those solo albums. So, what do you all think? Put your comments below on uh, what would you pick, man? And uh, thank you so much, Sky Star. And if you'd like to donate, I got a PayPal in the description below. And I also want to thank you all. All of you, including you, Sky Star, for still watching, still checking out my videos, especially you subscribers. I don't take you for granted. I love you all. I love you long time. And uh, those that, that haven't subscribed, please feel free to do so. And what am I reaching for down here? I don't know why I'm reaching down here. Reach down between my legs and nothing. Oh, man. Okay, man. Don't laugh at me, all right? It's, you know, having no penis is no joke of matter. You know? I blame it on my great-grandmother. It's true. My great-grandmother was Chinese. And no, I'm not being racist. Oh, okay, now a lot of people are going to be upset. Not all Chinese have uh, uh, little dicks. Well, hey, this guy with a little Chinese blood does, so... Hey, if I'm making fun of anybody, it's myself. I'm hung like a belly button. Seriously, like an inward belly button. It's embarrassing. Not cool. And stay frosty. Hey, I managed to stay frosty and I have no penis. And listen to Black Sabbath. And smack them a god. Bye.